Hey guys, it's Andy Son here doing a quick little vlog. Uh, it's just basically a, a tour of my basement before I uh, go to Bowling Green. This is my last day here, and uh, I just wanted to give you guys a quick little tour of the basement. And we're going to start from the tippy top. Notice it's all bright up here. Alright, check this out. You got stairs, and just the beginning of the wall of boredom that my mom painted when she was really, really bored. There's my newly acquired mini fridge, which was given to me by my parents. There's my big shadow. Let's see what's inside. Uh, some pop, water, my collection of waters, and a Capri Sun. A saw, that's not mine. Treadmill, old radio that we used to have like back when we lived in... Yeah, I think that's the radio we had back when we lived in Michigan. Lamp, workout equipment that's hardly ever used. Stuff, uh, scale. Let's see how fat I am. I am 215 pounds. Fuck me running. In fact, I should be running. Jesus. Water softener, water, uh, you know. <laughs> Drum set pretty nice. We should have done videos on it, but eh, we're more guitar people than drum people. This is our stepdads. These are the real drums, electronic drums, a little drum amp, a little stereo so you can, you know, drum to songs, like a little TV thing set up for like drum tutorials. Sticks and heads on the ab lounger, which is never ever used, ever. A little workout bike that's never used. Yeah, you'd think with all this workout equipment we'd be like the most fit people in the world. Not really. Anyway, moving on. We got my little rig set up. Uh, the little PV amp right here is right, my little youngest brother's amp. That's mine. Little Johnson no-name amp with my Korg tuner on top. Behringer Ultra Chorus, Chorus pedal. Uh, my Digitech Metal Master. I got those wired in and my Tube Screamer off to the side because I don't have an AC adapter for it because it broke. Here's John's stuff. He also has a Tube Screamer, but his is hooked in. His is wah. It's unhooked. Channel switcher, his Strat, and his Randall amp with his Korg tuner on top. And some books. And then we got a little, like, uh, wood table full of stuff, old cameras, and here's my desk. Well, th this technically isn't my desk. This is where I keep all my clothes. See, you got like underwear and socks on top, a pair of pants up here too. This is where my camera sits, and my camera battery. Looking inside, you can't see shit, but there's clothes in here. Well, I can see some clothes, and a little outline of the new Genshin shirt, give you guys a little preview of that. There's a new Genshin shirt. This is apparently Genshin you used new mascot. Um, I just threw out the name Ichigo Chan. Totally original, right? <laughs> There's the logo, which has been returned to in its entirety that I designed. They just kind of redid the letters so they're bigger. And it's got a quote from uh, L from Death Note on the back. I'll give you the strawberry if you keep it a secret. Got a little thing where I keep my socks and my her pants. This is my big fuzzy pillow. It is nice. It's also got like hoodies, my little uh, basket, and some playboys. And we got my chair, which I'm not bringing with me. And this is my desk. Look how clean it is. It is so clean and immaculate. Mm, look at all that no dust. Yeah. Got my desktop computer, my can of WD-40 with my can of air, calculator, game controller, uh, there's a printer and some figures, my phone, old school iPod, Grip Master, and my external hard drive, which has currently taken a crap on me. I'll get that fixed eventually, so I can get all my music and shit off. My MP3 player, which is over a mile long, according to Walmart. Mints, my super awesome Microsoft mouse from hell, which has seen days. My bitchin, like 14 inch monitor I think. And here's a neat little thing that came with the desk. It's a, it's a bookshelf kind of thing. It's only got, you know, three things, three shelves. But it holds my guitar magazines, Guitar World, which is my favorite. Um, I didn't like Guitar Player as much, honestly. Got Shonen Jumps, got the newest one with the Ultimo, which is like a manga made by Stan Lee. Eh. It's okay, I guess, for now. Got a Japanese-English dictionary right there. You can't really see it. An old issue of Total Guitar Magazine that I got. Only got that because it had Master of Puppets tab that was written correctly. Uh, Rolling Stone, Magic Deck, Magic the Gathering Deck. My video games, Nintendo DS, Game Boy games, Game Boy Mates SP, 
a bunch of crap that I got from Eric, uh, my old textbooks, and stuff like that. And I was trying to sell all these magazines on eBay, but I'm just too damn lazy to get them up there. Stereo system that never got installed. My prepaid legal stuff, which I'm supposed to get a refund for that soon. And here are the guitar straps from the guitars that I had to unfortunately sell. Here's where I keep all my DVDs. Ta-da! DVDs. That's pretty much it. Uh, more magazines in these two little bins. Um, you got my Dean Acoustic right here, and my K Les Paul copy here. Got a bunch of old stuff. There's photo albums. Those are old school photo albums. A uh, bunch of stuff here. Here's a picture of Owen Hart that I did like when I was in seventh grade. <laughs> I was so particular about his uh, about his uh, skin color that I completely screwed up the look of everything, so he looks all goofy. Plus, I was in like seventh grade, so yeah. Sorry if Owen looks all goofy. That was like just when he died at Over the Edge in '99. I actually, I would have been in eighth grade. My bad. This is an, a thing that my mom did, but it's upside down right now. It's a picture of a tiger. It's really nicely done. Glass case, headphone extension cord, and uh, DVDs of Comic Party. The first season, not Revolution. Just watching the first season of Comic Party. Getting to Revolution. A bunch of crap stuff in my bed. Pretty nondescript. Got several layers. You got the one blanket, or one comforter, two comforter, sheets, pillow, and the little under thing under that. Couch with a shit ton of towels on it. The two elongated chair, whatever, I don't know what they're called. It's got suede on it, it's kinda nice, but if you sit on certain parts it hurts. This is the little stand-up cooler where I keep my laptop. So, it's not here, it's upstairs right now. Xbox 360, it's not working. Controllers, PS2 was there. Surround sound system, that kinda works. Clock. Big screen TV, Toshiba by the way. Old school systems, phone that's not working right now. And the most interesting part of the house, the sub pump. Hmm, that is interesting. Also a dehumidifier, which is pretty useless down here since it's not very humid down here at all. And you got nice leather couch, which I was gonna get when I moved out, but since the apartment I'm moving is completely furnished, it's kinda pointless. Yeah, this couch is really nice. The only problem is it can get really, really cold, and there's little, like, scratches and stuff from our dog Zeus when he was a puppy. And, uh, leather recliner, which is a complete piece of crap. And we got a dresser here made of metal. This thing is old as fuck. And some other stuff. And we're back at our desk, my desk again. Some boxes. And that's pretty much it. Wow. For a short video, this sure lasted a long time. Well, this is the Andy Sullen signing off. Hope to see you at BG. Bye.